I've been in this fight a long time. I have no illusions about the fight that's in front of us. I have no illusions about distortions that will come from all sides. But I know full well the political obstacles that will be thrown up against us are not impenetrable. I have no illusions about how hard it's going to be. But I know this. We have no choice. We will not be able to look our kids and our grandkids in the eye if we don't use every energy, every, fi every bit of energy, every fiber in our being to try to keep them safer. We'll not be worthy of the generation that's going to grow up now without those 20 innocent kids and those thousands of people already lost. We'll not be able to stop every act of senseless gun violence or any other kind of violence. We know that in the future. But that's no excuse to do nothing. That is not an excuse to do nothing. As the President said, if we can save even one life, it's worth it. I believe together we can save a whole lot more lives than that. And I think we can begin again, not because of guns alone, but I think we can begin an endeavor that stops the coursing of American culture and society. I think we can begin to turn this around. It's not all because of guns. It's a lot of other things. But maybe what happened in Newtown is a call to action about more than just gun violence, about civility in our society.